before we start this video, be sure to like and subscribe, because there's going to be more awesome videos coming your way, and you're not going to want to miss out on the fun. Hey guys, so today we're going to be going back into my roots on Bloxburg, and it's been a while since I posted a Bloxburg video, and um, yeah, we're going to be taking a look at how much money I do spend on Bloxburg, and how crazy I get with Christmas decorations. Just just look at this. My house? My house is decorated for Christmas right now. It's I go all out for Christmas because Christmas is my favorite holiday. But how much do I actually spend on Bloxburg? With give or take that I have 1.3 million plus money and it's going to keep climbing and climbing and climbing. And Seriously, I work every single day for three hours at Bloxy Burgers because that's how dedicated I am. And yeah, and it's the Christmas update and some new things have been added within the 0.10.2 update. And we're going to be looking at some of those things. But, you know, my house currently is it is being decorated. That I haven't finished my house yet. If you can tell, there's an entire room over here that hasn't been finished. Um, I've been working on my house since December of last year, so, um, I think I'm a little late to the party, but it's just the house. Well, let's just go into build mode, and we're going to be looking at all the new update items. Um, so decorate the new, we have so many new items. Some of the new items I already have down on my plot, which is the, um, snowflake mat, um, the holiday gift candle. I don't have the toys out yet, um. I don't, I don't have the regular bear tree out, which I'm probably gonna put that out later. I have some of the holiday lights or the snow shovel will be useful. I have, I have some new lights on here, plus the inflatables. Um, you know, I don't have this inflatable out. Let's see if this will fit over here. Oh yes, it will fit over here. So I think I can put the inflatable there. Okay, well, we are going to see how much money I actually spend on Bloxburg. And you guys can can see I have a lot of trees around here and Christmas decorations plus like a lot of this. I think I spent about two hundred thousand dollars just on Christmas decorations, and that is not even half of the Christmas decorations that I'm going to be put up for Christmas on Bloxburg because you know Christmas is my favorite holiday. I love Christmas. It's the best time of the year, um, and it's it's just it's just the best time of the year because that's when most of the family comes over to one person's house. And they are just, you know, giving. They're giving. And a lot of people love it when family are over. And I love it when family is over. Because, you know, I love family. And I love Christmas. I just love Christmas. Um, give or take. I spent, like, I spent $200,000 on Christmas decorations. And, like, back then, when I was posting Bloxburg videos back then, which I think was, like, I was, I was, just re I was really young when I was posting Bloxburg videos back then. And, um... I wouldn't have imagined myself with like 1.3 million dollars and building this nice mansion, um, decorating this much for Christmas, and like I think back then, like last Christmas, I didn't have this house. I was I've been building this house since last Christmas, and this is my only plot. So this is the first time I'm decorating the house. I was I've also decorated the house for Halloween, which I've gotten some Halloween items, and I think Bloxburg's Halloween inventory is broken because I know I've had some spider webs. The spider web, um, garland, and um, a few other things, but that is Halloween, and that's over. I can get that next year. Um, it only cost me twenty dollars. Um, oh my god, I forgot to delete some stuff. I am very lazy. Um, but if we look at this, I've spent so much money, just let alone on this, and I still only have give or take a few rooms to finish. Um, if you look at this, I still have this room in the closet to finish. I still have the shower area to finish, which I might turn that into a gymnasium. So I still have this to finish. That's like one, two, three rooms, because I still have this room to finish. So it's like three rooms so far. So like one, two, three, then three rooms to finish so far. A fourth room, then a fifth room, the sixth room. And then seventh room, I, I still have a lot to do for this house. And this house so far, 
um, if we get out of build mode. It's, it, it so far cost $766,285, and this house is supposed to cost one plus, one million plus. And I think this is, I, um, before I had this house, it was actually the same house I had with this. It was a Beverly Hills mansion that I got off of YouTube. Um, but I just remodeled it to make it more modern because I love the modern style. Um, and I, and like, I, I love modern homes. So I, I took off like the, I took it off from like the Beverly Hills mansion. I, I just like re renovated it to be like more modern, more me, um, and everything. Give or take, I spend, that means like if I spent $200,000 on my house, not on my house, on Christmas decorations. That means I spent about five hundred thousand dollars on the house alone, which means that my house so far cost five hundred thousand dollars. The Christmas decorations are only just two hundred thousand dollars so far. I think that's what I think. I haven't cared to check about my house plot value. I might have only spent a hundred thousand dollars on this, and I could spend more. Like I just love Christmas. Like I I, I love Christmas. But if we take a look in my house and like on everything on the things i've spent money on because like i spent a lot of money on things and um in here i have a car it's supposed to be filled up with all cars so i'm still in the process of getting the money for the cars oh my god the door doesn't want to close okay so now we're gonna go over to the kitchen because that's where we can see all the stuff that i spent um so let's go over to the kitchen and my kitchen is just a beautiful kitchen i love it i spent money on this gingerbread house two things of cookies and oh my god and if we view my content i spent so much money on witch's brew bloxy cola some chips canned beans watermelon banana bloxy egg grapes water bottle apple coffee i've made some festive cake pops holiday tree brownies and gingerbread cookies which i'm going to be stocking up on those so I can have those after the Christmas season. But now if we, we're going to take a look at some of these prices. So first let's take a look at the stuff I've baked so far and see the prices and see how they don't even matter to my like $1.3 million. Um, so if we take ingredients, so the first thing we're going to look over is the holiday cookies. They are only $15. That's not, even a, that's not even a lot of money for me. That's just $15. And for gingerbread cookies, it's just 20, which is not expensive to me. We have the best cake box, which is thirty-six. Not like things are starting to get expensive to some people. Sixty-eight dollars I spent on a gingerbread house. Um, Fifty-two dollars I spent on holiday tree brownies, and I had to get my levels up so I can make the Yule log cake because I think that's a new item for Christmas is a Yule log cake. So I have to get up to level seven. Um, but right now we're gonna go into my elevator. And we're going to go down to my car and we're going to go to the store to see all these prices on Bloxburg. To see how much I'm actually spending on money. So I, give or take, spent like about, a mi I spent a million, almost a million dollars. Because I used to have two million. So give or take, spend 300,000 more than I'm at, than I spent a million dollars. Um, and yes, I'm poor. As soon as I dip down from a million, I'm going to be poor. I'm going to name myself as poor because, um... Okay, now we're back. I somehow got kicked out of the game because Bloxburg decided my internet want... Well, I don't think it was Bloxburg that decided that. But I think my internet just cut out on me for one second. So now we're going to get into my car and we're going to go down to the store. Um... So let's try this out. Um, we're going to go down to the store and we're going to see how much money... I think I go this way. Yeah, I go this way. We're going to see how much money I actually spend on Bloxburg. And I want to take you through my entire work process on what, on what I do. Or maybe not. I might leave that for another video on how you can get millions and millions of dollars. So yeah, I'm addicted to Bloxburg. I, I, I'm on here for hours on end. Okay, so we're going to go down to the store. So I know we have some bananas and grapes and everything. Oh, so canned beans are only $4.00. Okay, apples are only two, two dollars. Yeah, I don't spend a lot of money on this. And we have the Bloxy Cola. There's no witch's brew because I think that was only like a Halloween thing. We have block. We have water bottle, which is just two dollars. I really wish we could buy cheese from here. Like seriously. I know I had bought some watermelons, so like, 
Watermelon is five dollars. Like this stuff isn't even expensive. Like it isn't even expensive at all. I think I might just buy some more apples for my fridge. Yes, I buy some more boxy colas. So wow, I really didn't spend a lot of money. And guys, the Alpun is back this year. Um, this is actually my first time doing the Alpun. I didn't do it last year. I didn't feel like doing the Alpun last year. Um, but now it gives me free money, so I won't do the Alpun. Um, but yeah, this is where I spend hours on end working. Um, I spend three hours a day here working ten. I, I usually, when I'm working, I have an episode of a TV show playing so I can work. So I also work here at some points of the day. I usually work here for about an hour. So three hours plus an hour, basically four hours of me working. But no, I, I grind at this game a lot. And I do get bored of it. Yes, I do get bored of it because the updates, if you look at it. Um, I am grateful for the updates. I'm super grateful for the updates. I am thankful for the developers that put out these updates and everything. Yeah, but my house is just so beautiful. Um, but yeah, I'm usually in here for about six hours on Mac sometimes. That is give or take when I'm not in school. Yeah, so it's give or take when I'm not in school. So on the weekends, I'm on here for six hours at Mac. When I'm in school, I'm usually on here for like two hours. Um, but three hours for the work period, obviously. But I'm usually in here for sometimes for two hours. But yeah, like my house, I'm actually going to give you guys a house tour when my house is finished. So I wanted to get it finished before Christmas. So before Christmas, you'll be seeing a house tour. Um, but but yeah, I think that should be the end of the video here. I think it was a short video. But you know, I'm very addicted to Bloxburg. And I think, I think I'm going to sign off for the day on Bloxburg. Because I've actually been grinding at this game for like a while now. And, um, just spending more money on Christmas decorations. I think I should spend more money on Christmas decorations, or maybe not. I don't think this is enough Christmas decorations. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll be back with another video, either if it's going to be Bloxburg or if a different video. But thank you guys so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. Can't wait to see you guys in the next one.